Hi guys, it's Nicole. I've done this like 15 times at this point and I just don't like intros, you know? Basically, this is going to be my little junior year move back to my parents for the summer vlog thing. Um, this is gonna be really interesting because <sighs> My parents are coming for me tomorrow. I was supposed to do a whole bunch of stuff yesterday. Mm, my parents are coming today, it's after midnight. Um, it's like two in the morning. I was supposed to do a whole bunch of stuff before it became two in the morning, but instead I got some Del Taco and I don't know, that was hours ago and I don't really know what happened, but I have to go check my mail. I have to do the dishes. I have to do the laundry. I have to bleach some things. I have to disassemble my ring light. And then tomorrow's gonna be a problem because I have to go down to this little boutique because I want a free t-shirt and I don't want to wake up any earlier than I have to, like before my parents come. But it turns out my parents might be coming kind of late because my dad has to watch the SpaceX launch and he has to do it live. So things got pushed back because of that. I don't really know what this is going to be, hopefully not all Awful, but I feel like my parents and I are gonna be here t today until midnight, so I should probably do some things before my mom wrecks me. This is truly the walk of shame. This is an entire lease worth of mail that I never checked. I am just now realizing that it says cowboy cannabis. <sighs> Welcome to Oklahoma. I feel kind of bad for the mailman. Oh my god. <laughs> I am that asshole. Everything was just shoved in there because it's such a tiny mailbox. I could barely get it out. I have a habit of not checking my mail through the entire lease, but I have never gotten this much. This is all junk. Honestly, I don't need a bank. I'm unemployed. That's not my name. God, they're still sending me the mail of the person who lived here before me. Ooh. Oh, look at this. A nice, we wish you a Merry Christmas. The census. Oh shit, response required by law. I'm sure my mom took care of that. I don't really live here. It's so crumpled up because there was just no room. Oh my God, this is all going in the trash. Maybe I should leave it for my mom. Coupons for haircuts. That's such a pipe dream. November coupons for haircuts. So do they not know I have no money to put in the bank? A veteran special. Do they even know who I am? Mm, from a funeral home. Yes, I'll, I'll be needing one of those soon. Why are you sending me mail for another university when I obviously go to this one? You think I can afford that? More banks. These people think I'm a lot richer than I am. Is it illegal to not check your mail? Because I have so many other people's mails. Well, I don't know, that's their responsibility to forward it. I'm not donating plasma. I'm back. I have brushed my hair. I have a lot of things to do, but they kind of need to be done after I take a shower because I have to wash my shower curtain. I have to bleach my shower caddies. I have to do laundry, including the clothes that I'm wearing on my body. I have to do the dishes. I have to eat a second meal before I do the dishes. And I gotta clean out my fridge. So the reason I have not done anything I need to do prior to today was because I was in a fight with iCloud for three days. That's all I did, and then, I don't know, I feel like I closed my eyes a little bit for a minute there. Let's get this fridge sorted. I literally hate my next building neighbors because they're like on the third floor, I'm on the first, and they are up there and they just scream with the window open like every night. And God, I feel so bad for their actual neighbors because if like my building can hear them. Uh, okay, we have coconut milk. Probably expired. Let's check. That's fine. Hell yeah, coconut milk, October 2020. This cream has got a go, though. I don't know if that's a good idea anymore. Oh yeah, such not a good idea. This is overwhelming me. So fun story about this bread. Uh, I bought it at Walmart and I was trying to buy it quickly because I was like, I only have two slices of bread left. Haven't even eaten those two slices. And I was like, I need a new loaf. So I go to Walmart and nobody's wearing a mask and they're all standing like this close to me. And so I decide I'm just gonna grab the first freaking Italian loaf I see and I'm gonna be on my way. And I show it to my mom over FaceTime. I'm like, look mom, like I bought myself bread. Like I can sustain myself. And she was like, you bought bread on sale? And I was like, oh, oh yeah. I brought bread on sale. Like I'm a, a bargain hunter. I know how to, how to live. And she's like, well, when bread is on sale, it means it's close to expire. It expired on May 23rd. I was so proud. This is really weird because this is where I like film, obviously. But now we're gonna be taking this bad boy down because my mom is coming with the bag that I was not able to purchase with the ring light. So she wants me to disassemble it before she gets here because I don't know, the look of it assembled overwhelms her. I will also be linking the ring light and the bag that I bought separately down below if you guys want to check it out for your own videos. It's the opposite of an unboxing, a boxing. Yeah! 
that was easy enough. Now I'm gonna, I might eat some ice cream because there's way too much in the fridge. It's really late. I need to take a shower so that I can do everything else. Talk to you guys later. Hey guys, it's 4.11 in the morning. Um, I'm trying to get through all this milk that I told my mom I finished a while ago. So that's my little 4 a.m. dinner. Uh, I have a whole bunch of bread I need to eat. I'm gonna make some toast and see if I can do that. But other than that, I've not taken a shower. I have not washed my shower curtain and I have not bleached anything I need to bleach. So I'll get back to you on that. Good morning vlog. It is 1 p.m. and I have just woken up. Uh, I only slept a few hours. My parents are almost here and we're gonna do some some packing, some moving. God, it is the last thing I wanna be doing right now. Uh, I guess my dad decided not to watch the SpaceX launch. I'm trying to be strong for him. I also gotta go get my free t-shirt from that one place. So we're gonna be doing that. Hey guys, so my parents are here. Here's mom. I didn't know if I was gonna like have dad in it because I don't know, he doesn't know I'm like doing this yet. And he shows up and I look out the window and I see my parents coming and my dad's got like this big toolbox and he comes up to the door and he's walking and he like trips and he's like, it's uphill here. How many times did you come home drunk and fall? <laughs> yes, he said that to me. That's the first thing he said to me is how many times did you come up here and fall when you were drunk? I'm like, never. And then he immediately just starts eating my food. He goes straight to the fridge and pulls out a huge hunk of cheese. It's vegan cheese, and I do not tell him. Well, first of all, if you're gonna eat someone's groceries, you can't just, you know, oh, the finest cheddar. Like, it's vegan, like, sorry. But he starts, like, slicing chunks to eat. Who does that? Who just comes over to someone's house at 1 p.m. and is like, I'm gonna eat a whole bunch of cheese. And then he starts eating my Oreos. I'm like, those are vegan too. Now my mom and I are going to get that T-shirt that I won. Um, and my dad, he actually just, it wasn't that he didn't want to watch the SpaceX launch. He wanted to do it on my computer while he's laying in my bed. It's not that he missed it. It's not that he like sacrificed to help me. He's gonna be watching it while my mom and I are packing. Hey guys, so we just got way too many t-shirts. Inside the store, we were the only people wearing masks, other than employees. And this little girl outside of the restaurant store place just sneezes into the air, like, Hella! like all over everything. My dad has left. We're uh, mostly packed. She's getting drunk now. Cheers. As you do. We're almost done. How you feeling, Mom? Excellent. <laughs> drunk as hell behind me. Okay, so my dad was pulling command hooks off the wall, and this wasn't really his fault, but like suddenly the paint chipped, and it was like a big chunk of paint. And so we go to Lowe's to get some paint, like to touch it up. And the employee couldn't match it that well. He was like, this is a really small sample. Like it was just a little fourth inch chip he made. And so he was like, well, if it doesn't match, just come back with a bigger sample. Like, hey dad, can you do that again? But like, like you mean it. Don't ever do this kind of thing with your blinds because then they're going to break and then you're going to be spending 30 minutes with the windows open, letting every passerby watch you thread them back together. So 
that is it for this vlog. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. We have an hour and a half to drive, so we're gonna go do that. The semester was definitely unconventional and not at all what I wanted out of the semester, but I still was able to get a 4.0 and I'm still very grateful that I was not living on campus this semester because then I would have had to move out in March and complete the semester at my parents' house. So it's a little better that I'm getting to do that now when I don't have any work to do. That is all I have for you guys today. I hope you are staying safe and make sure to like this video, comment and subscribe if you'd like to see more. And I hope you all have an amazing day. Bye guys. That is how you do it, ladies and gentlemen. I have made mistakes.